Hey everyone, and welcome to the Tech Channel. Today we're gonna see how to use the DHT22. It's like the DHT11. They are both uh, sensors for temperature and humidity. It's just like the other one. There are just a difference in uh, temperature range and humidity range. Also accuracy and the refresh rate. I will show you the difference in a table. It will show up here. And so I'm gonna wire it with my Arduino. I'm using Arduino Uno as always and I will use an LCD I2C screen so if you want to see how to use the DHD11 it's in the link uh, right below also if you want to see how to use the LCD screen it's pretty simple link right below too and first I'm gonna wire it with my Arduino Uno uh, alone and show the temperature and humidity in my serial monitor so for the wiring it's pretty simple there are two versions of the DHT11 and the DHT22 there are 4 pin version like this or 3 pin version like this and usually we only connect 3 pins and they are not uh, different just the number of the pins and we're gonna wire it with our Arduino so starting from here it's connected to VCC it works with 3.3 volt or 5 volt I'm gonna use 5 volt and then we have the data pin which is here then the third one is not connected and the fourth one is for the ground I'm gonna wire it with my Arduino and I'm using also a braid board and some jump wires connect the ground the ground from Arduino then third one is not connected so the second will go to pin number 7 you can use every, uh, one of the digital pins as you, you want and then we have the VCC to 5 volt and I will upload my code show it to you first so this is the code I'm using to show like the temperature and humidity in my serial monitor. It's pretty simple. Uh, thanks to the DHT point ash uh, library, it's pretty simple to use. It works both for like the DHT11 and the DHT22. Then we declare the DHT as a DHT type. Then here we declare the pin where we wired our DHT. We can use whatever pin uh, we want. Here I use the seven. Then the serial monitor, like wall well, right, you know the things. Then we have uh, this int, it's at uh, CHK, it reads the temperature and the humidity and stock them in this uh, val value. And here we must use read 22. For DHT11, you use read 11. And here I add, since the measure, measures are done in uh, Celsius and in percent for uh, humidity and uh, temperature. Here I add like a conversion to show it in Fahrenheit also and you can remove like the temperature in Celsius or in Fahrenheit if you want you just add like a comment like this now we can remove Fahrenheit or you can remove the Celsius if you want it's up to you like the system you are using and here like uh, for the transformation I write like temperature and here DHT dot temperature which is the temperature in uh, Celsius then uh, I add like a uh, symbol for Celsius and I print it also in the Fahrenheit with uh, its symbol then we have uh, humidity and we take the parameter DHT dot humidity which, uh, <coughs> which correspond to humidity sorry then here we have the delay which is uh, 2 seconds, it reads every 2 seconds this is the min, like the maximum rate of the refresh rate of the DHT22 it's uh, 2 seconds, like uh, here it's 0 0.5 Hz so it like it reads uh, once in every 2 seconds for the DHT11 it reads one in every second but that's not a problem uh, because the DHT22 is more accurate and have uh, like a bigger range and here I'm gonna upload this code to my Arduino board and see the result here so 
so this is it uh, we show like the temperature and humidity temperature print in Celsius and in Fahrenheit then humidity in percent it's pretty humid uh, over here so this is it for the DHT22 which it's uh, to write in the monitor now we're gonna add like our LCD I to C screen it's pretty simple just some wiring and another code and we'll go back to the uh, to its code again so that was for the DHT22 with the serial monitor now we're gonna add like the LCD I to C screen as I said if you want to know how to use it it's in the link right below it's pretty simple just don't have like the problem of the library confusion which a lot of people have like uh, and it will not function make sure how to install correctly your library and we're gonna wire it now we're gonna need like a uh, 5 volt and ground from here I'm gonna take it from here directly Then the SDA and the SCL is from like uh, A4 and A5 as we saw in many projects. So this is it for the wiring, pretty simple. Now we're gonna upload the second code. This is it for the second code, it's also quite uh, simple. Uh, like we add the liquid crystal I2C library for the LCD. Then it's parameter as we saw before, like the address, I to see address, then declaring some pins and declaring the LCD as a type of uh, liquid crystal, I to see. Then we add like some uh, backlights and uh, uh, LCD home and begin to launch our uh, LCD that we saw before. Then here there is no difference just like we clear uh first we clear like uh, our screen just not to get the uh, number conf confused then we set our cur cursor to 0, 0 0.0 and we read again like before and we show the temperature in celsius and humidity in percent i think this percent doesn't show well but we're gonna keep it and it refresh every two seconds so like uh, I will leave another uh, code, it's for the Fahrenheit, it's pretty simple too, I'm gonna show it now. This is the code for the Fahrenheit version, it shows like we add the conversion from Celsius to Fahrenheit and show it. There is no big difference between them. And now I'm gonna upload it to my card, I'm gonna upload like Celsius to my board, Arduino board. So this is it for the temperature and humidity and we show the like uh, results on the lcd i2c screen and so it's very simple also the code very simple if you want to adapt it to your uh, project and here we are showing temperature in celsius and humidity it's uh, always in percent here the like the percentage symbol didn't show up it's maybe like a problem in the library of the lcd i2c sorry or you can remove it if you want so this is pretty simple, I'm gonna blow on the, on the sensor As you can see temperature is uh, increasing a little bit but the humidity is uh, increasing a lot uh, I think it's uh, like far beyond the range, that's why it's showing 99.90 it's the maximum I think so this is for the DHT22 and all links like for uh, codes and uh, wiring will be found in, the, in uh, right below uh, thank you for watching and see you next time <music>